Researchers at Colorado State University are trying to figure out if migratory birds are adapting to climate change at a different pace than their food, which is mostly insects. If the insects are changing their patterns, then the birds must do the same or they may starve. You know, if they're not changing their timing, that's potentially quite problematic, right? That the insect, it's very clear that plants and insects are responding to warmer temperatures and earlier warmer temperatures. If the birds can't sense that, um, you know, there's really no way for them to, to keep up with these uh, rapidly changing environments. Kyle Horton, a professor at CSU, has started a new study to track the migrations of purple martins, tree swallows, and Mexican free-tailed bats, all of which are species that feed on flying insects. And the birds that eat insects seem to be struggling. Uh, their populations seem to be declining most rapidly. He says uncovering the specific timing of how their migrations have changed over time may be the key to understanding why the birds numbers are dwindling as soon as the sun rises all of those birds take flight and he's using national weather service radars which are evenly spread across all 50 states to track them it's not just weather that shows up on radar bird movements are also recorded we're trying to do the inverse of what meteorologists do right we want to remove the precipitation we don't necessarily care about the rain estimation we care about the biology um, so we're, we're sort of flipping the switch on what's relevant to us. Horton now has nearly 30 years of archived radar images to help him unravel the mystery of these unhealthy migratory birds. Meteorologist Corey Repenhagen, 9 News.